Mom slips into a coma while pregnant, still in coma on son's fifth birthday. God gives and he takes away. What we need to do is have a little faith and believe that he has a plan and that in the long run, everything will be all right. Heather and Sean Brown first met when they were on a blind date. Although Sean had cold feet, the two of them hit it off almost immediately. When the couple decided to expand their family, however, they had a tough time for almost seven whole years. But their weight paid off in 2012 when they learned that they were about to have a beautiful little boy. Sean says that they wanted this so badly. Doctors told her that she would never be fertile, so when we got the great news, it didn't sink in at first. We were in awe and shock. Sean was away serving with the National Guard posted in Afghanistan and soon his wife was 34 weeks pregnant. She was experiencing some back pain and a headache and decided to get it checked out. However, Heather soon started having seizures due to her massive brain bleed. The doctors had no other choice but to immediately perform an emergency C-section. Heather slipped into a coma soon after and her baby was taken to the NICU of a neighboring hospital to be taken care of. Sean received the news via email from Heather's aunt. After a conversation with her on the phone, he came home in a hurry. I hitchhiked on different planes to get home, he recalled. It took three days, but I finally got to them. After three days of no communication, Sean finally arrived at the hospital with a police escort. He first went to see his baby boy and sadly recalled the moment he first held him in his arms. He then rushed over to see his wife. Doctors told Sean that his wife may never recover from her coma. After a year at the hospital, Heather finally came home after showing signs of progress. She's still progressing even today. In the recent years, she's even made efforts to move and speak. Sean keeps the family updated on her condition via Facebook page where he posts videos of her progress. John, Heather's son, loves to spend time besides mom and hopes that she'll wake up soon so they can finally get to know each other the way they were supposed to. Although the future remains uncertain, the family is still relying on hope and prayers that Heather will wake up. The Facebook page dedicated to her recovery says that, but we know our God is in the business of miracles. We believe through the power of prayer, Heather will wake up and we believe this Brown is coming home too. Please share this story and a prayer for the Brown family.